Pat Carr, you done it again. Hey guys, so the other day, as you saw in some of uh, hopefully other videos that you, you watched, I saw my coolant reservoir, my expansion tank. As you can see, coolant's red, but there's a bunch of white foam on the top, and that's what happens with, when water and coolant mix with oil, it turns white. Now, luckily, I didn't see any on the dipstick, so probably not horrible, but there's a few things it could be, and I wanted to show you guys all the possibilities that I'm aware of. First and foremost is a head gasket. Now, there's a couple different ways a head gasket can fail. There's coolant passages, uh, there's oil passages in there, and there's the holes for the combustion chambers, the cylinders. And so, most common when a head gasket fails, it's between the coolant passages and the combustion chambers. And so, you'll get coolant into the uh, combustion chamber and pressurized air from the combustion chamber into the cooling system. Easy way to check that is I took the radiator cap off, started it up. If a bunch of coolant shoots out, obviously what, you know, 600 PSI or more in those cylinders, it's the uh, coolant is going to shoot right out of that radiator cap. But it did not. So at least in that fashion, the head gasket hasn't failed. But what can also happen is the oil or coolant can be leaking out of the side, not beginning in the combustion chamber. It's not as big of a deal because head gaskets are very, very uh, intricate uh, repair there. And it might be leaking down the side of the block. Not that big of a deal. It could still be driven. But what may be going on here is the coolant and oil may be uh, mixing there, but I don't see any oil or coolant uh, leaking on the side. So there's a handful of other things it could be besides the head gasket. Let's get into it. Try the engine over here. And this is your EGR cooler. What it does is you have uh, exhaust gas and it's got a little valve here and it mixes with your intake uh, gases for you know better fuel atomization and, and emissions. So you don't have quite as much emissions going out of the exhaust in the DPF filter. But the problem is you don't want all that hot, hot air going into your cooling system. So it runs like an air to, air, uh, air to water intercooler. It runs coolant through here. And uh, there could be some places, some gaskets that share oil and coolant passages, passages there. So my mechanic says, most likely, it's the EGR cooler. Here what we have is a heat exchanger. Now what a heat exchanger is, it's not a radiator, but what happens is they run oil and coolant side by side by side. You see how it's sandwiched there. They run it side by side in different passages. So the water will absorb the heat from the oil, cool it effectively with the radiator, keep it at a constant temperature, keep it warm, also keep it cool, just keep it regulated. And mm, I guess I can see a little bit of oil there, but uh, we'll see if that's uh, what's leaking. But that could also be a possibility. Now, number three that I'm aware of that is probably pretty likely is the timing assembly here, where you got a bunch of gears that are shared with the water pump, uh, here's the water pump right here, but it's shared with the, um, you know, camshaft and, and crank crankshaft and all that mess and uh, your air, uh, not your air compressor, your power, uh, yeah, your air compressor, uh, power steering pump. Now, I see a little bit of leak in here. So that is very well, maybe what it could be is the uh, power steering pump right here is failing because here's a filter for the coolant <clears throat> because those gears in here need to be lubricated and it runs right next to the uh, coolant so most likely it's somewhere around here and needs just needs a new water pump hopefully that's it 
but I just wanted to give you a handful of possibilities that it could be if you end up having water in your oil or oil in your water, a bunch of white stuff on there. If you end up having that, those are the possibilities that I'm aware of. I'm not a mechanic, so I don't know 100%, but uh, that it very well may be.